is verse 36 of the 19th chapter of the Gospel of John. Uh, John is narrating the uh, incident of the soldiers coming. They wanted to hasten the death of the uh, criminals who had been crucified. And of course, they broke the legs of two of them to hasten their death by crucifixion. They come to Christ and discover that he's already dead. John has told us about piercing the side and outflowing blood and water. Uh, and then all of this he kind of wraps up now in this comment tying it to Old Testament prophecy. So we have again that toe. This is the uh, third person singular aorist middle in form indicative. Uh, commonly translated something like it came to pass or these things happened or this happened, something like that. Uh, it came about, uh, post-positive gar, so for this came about, or this took place. And then the plural subject of this is tauta, of course a plural subject can take a singular noun as, or a singular verb as we have here. So for these things came about, or these things happened, henna, conjunction, takes the subjunctive, which we have down here. So these things happen in order that, and then he grafe, the scripture, uh, have uh, plerothe from pleroo, it means to bring to fulfillment, to bring to completion. Uh, and uh, so John sees all of these events as fulfilling the anticipated Old Testament expectation of Messiah. Ostun, uh, of course, uh, this is the word for bone. We have various English words. Uh, osteo, those kinds of words, uh, will go back to this uh, word. It's the uh, nominative here of this neuter noun. So, ustun, a bone. Uh, the negation, u, suntribesetai. This is from suntribo. It means to break something. Uh, and uh, this is the passive here, so we have uh, a fu uh, the future passive, so third person singular, future passive indicative, a bone, u, negation, will not be broken, and then of him, of course, the possessive, uh, going back then to the word bone, so a bone of him will not be broken. Uh, in the Old Testament, the Passover lamb, of course, was not to be mutilated in that way. A bone was not to be broken. Psalm 34 makes an, a reference to a bone not being broken. And uh, that seems to be what John has in mind as he uh, notes uh, as an eyewitness of the events that are transpiring here.